Is there a plan for a new world order, a one world government, and how do we stop it? Well, I, I think even uh, our first uh, uh, President Bush uh, said that the New World Order was uh, in, 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 in tune, and that's what they were working for. The UN is part of that government. They're working right now very significantly for a North American Union. That's why there's a lot of people in Washington that don't care too much about our borders. They have a philosophic belief that national sovereignty is not important. It's also the reason I have made very strong suggestion that we need not be in the United Nations for our national security. What do you think about our borders and the immigration policy? Well, they, our borders have been totally neglected. We worry more about the borders between North and South Korea and between Iraq and Syria than we do about our own. Absolutely. Just recently, a bunch of our border guards were picked up and sent and, and enticed to go over to Iraq. It's insane. I mean, we should have more border guards, and the only way you can afford it and get the personnel is bring our troops home, worry about ourselves. We don't even have the money to find this, this world empire that we operate under. We have to borrow almost $3 billion a day just to pay for the war and our extravagance. And we borrow it from none other than China and Japan. I mean, we don't even have enough wealth produced in this country to finance the, the amount of spending that we have. And it will come to an end, and I think most Americans realize it. Middle class Americans and poor Americans have already suffered the consequences. Their standard of living has already started down. Those who are doing well know deep down in their heart they're doing